Hey, I uh, just want to do a quick content warning on this video this week. Um, I just don't feel comfortable loading it up blind, I guess. Um, so there is a pretty graphic depiction of suicide in this video. And um, yeah, if you're not comfortable with that, um, wait till next week. <laughs> And uh, on with the video. Hey, it's Kim here and welcome back to Out of Time, which is episode two of Life is Strange. I've got a little more time today to play some more, so I don't know, I've just been stressed about a gun for a half an hour, so hopefully I could be less stressed this time, but knowing this game, probably not. It's just gonna be stress forever. <laughs> so we just had Frank take the gun from us. I can't us. believe you basically gave him my gun. Here you go, Frank. I don't know, I was not shooting a person. Especially for stupid shit. I'm not mad. It adds up in my mind as people letting me down. Really? And I just liked having that gun, man. Great. Get a license then. Don't just have a gun. Now you have me to protect you. Aww. I'm just glad you were here. Me too. I think. <laughs> Chloe, why the hell are you hanging around scary losers like Frank? It's weird. Let's take a break and I'll talk. Yeah, I'm really like here about you. I'm being thinking about it. like a different much. world, huh? Why are you laying on forever. train tracks? There were trains! Can we build another pirate board and keep the world out? This is a, a dumb idea. Hangout. At least Frank wouldn't find us. Are you okay, Max? I'm freaked out. <laughs> I'm still freaked out about what happened. That was awful, Chloe. I'm sorry. But Frank isn't as hardcore as he fronts. All he cares about is his cash, stash, and Oh, he's a caravan guy. Chloe, are you for reals? Frank just took your gun and threatened us. He's armed and clearly dangerous. Max, I know. Crazy shit is the new normal for me. That's why I plan to leave Arcadia Bay without paying Frank off. Now, tell me exactly what's going on between you and Frank. Does he have a last name? Yeah, why do you always know? Frank Bowers, he's just a dealer uh, where I get my weed. The one in your joint, remember? Anyway. Frank and I kind of hung out. Hung out? Hung out? You don't mean you... Oh, no, we didn't have sex. <laughs> Gross, man. He never even tried. I just made the mistake of borrowing money so Rachel and I could bail out of here. That's it? No. I want to know how Frank got Rachel's bracelet. Yeah, that's weird. What do you think? Does he have the folder? Be careful or my brain is fried. I think we have to be careful and keep an eye on this guy. Without him eyeballing us, he okay? has the folder. That's so weird talking to you about this insane crap. We haven't hung out this much since we were tweens. And it's like no time has passed. I have a couple of friendships like that. I wish Rachel was here to meet you. Rachel and I? Do you think that Rachel and I would have been friends? You're not that different. She had... has a great eye for images and for art. Plus, she's a smartass like you. <laughs> We would all be hella best friends forever. Aww. I know she must be I'm as glad I added my are. name then. I have no doubt we'll meet soon. Railroad tracks always make me feel better. I have no idea why. Makes you feel like you're on track? Like you're Care going somewhere? It's the romance of travel and movement. The sound of the train whistle at night. Look at the beat poet here. <laughs> I'm so nervous that you're laying on these train tracks. Multiple trains I'd went past. I'd rather be a good photographer. You are. You just have to stop being afraid. I don't know, I think that's a pretty designer, artist, illustrator thing. Perfect. To feel uh, what is happening. But uh, imposter syndrome, they call it. Like, nothing you do is good enough. God! Why are we jumping in time? Oh, this is making me feel cold. What? Hold on, Chloe. What? Where did you shove your foot? Why were you like, I'm nervous, my controller is vibrating. What's that noise? The train. Look, the train. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. 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 Max, you can't just yank Chloe out like a superhero. Get me out of here, Max. Shit. 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 I'm panicking. Switching lever. Pull it. Pull it. What if it's... Which way is it? Awesome, it's not locked. Turn it off. What does that do? Pull the red, the red, the red, the red. Make it. I better find a tool to cut those wires. 
I told him to cut the wires. What if I pull the lever? I can't even move it an inch. Shit. I know there's a train coming. Take your foot out of your fucking shoe, Chloe. Oh my god. Take, take, take. Come on, come on, come on. Definitely need this guy. Stop thinking about it. Oh my god! It was coming! It was coming! It was coming! It was coming! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Crowbar it! Crowbar it! Crowbar? For real? Shit! Shit! Max, get me out of here! I am trying, Chloe. Stop yelling at me! Rewind, 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 I can see it. <laughs> okay, it's open, it's open. Draw, draw, open. Come on, scissors or yes, 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 they're wire cutters. Pick them up, 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 pick them up. Hurry, 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 hurry. Do I still have him? I still have him. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I'm coming! But which wire to cut? Red? Ooh. Now that's the right cable. Oh, thank god. Okay. What? So now we pull it? Yes! I did it! Jesus Christ! Don't lay! Okay. On train tracks! You saved me again. Crazy. Now we're totally bonded for life. Damn. That was close. Oh my god. Aren't you glad I took you away to a nice, quiet, desolate spot? It was cool to spend time in there, but I have to get back to school before my next class. Since you're the mysterious superhero, I'll be your faithful chauffeur and companion. Oh my god. My powers might not last, Chloe. That's okay. Stop. We will. Forever. Oh. That's gonna be the end of the episode, isn't it? Oh god, now so oh, fuck. <sighs> I'm stressed. <laughs> Thanks for the ride, Chloe. Right on time for my art lesson. Thanks for coming with me. Sorry to be so boring. <laughs> Nothing exciting ever happens to us, right? Oh, the sarcasm. Listen, your rewind power has to be connected to that snow yesterday. Probably. That might explain your tornado vision. Explain what? Yeah. Explain what? Snow equals the ginormous twister that takes out Arcadia Bay? I don't think... You're high. That's... Wake up, Max. You saved my life twice now. Yeah, things are going you on. You the course of my destiny, yours and whoever. Do you know about chaos theory? Yes. Uh, let's say, what do you know, though? What do you know about chaos theory, Miss I Hate Math? It's all about Five Jurassic Five years Park, ago, man. asswipe. Some people change. And your situation is the perfect storm for quantum physics. Why me? I'm just a geek girl in some small town. A perfect example of strange attractors? <laughs> Don't they teach you kids anything at Blackwell? No. We have a tornado, rewind power, and freak snow. Hello, Armageddon. So let's party with your power, Rockstar! No. Like he said, Professor Price, a superhero needs a sidekick. And How can it be such a shitty week and yet one of the best of my life? Because we're back in action again. Don't just fuck around. But I just have fun. Bye, Chloe. Thanks for the ride. Oh, this is going to be the end of the episode. I think. Seems like it. They're playing music. <laughs> I'm nervous about my choices. Enter the Vortex Club. See, I thought that was the rich kids thing. Hall of Fame. I have a little time before Mr. Jefferson's class, so I can do some wondering. Okay. I guess we can talk to some people and see what happens. I guess we'll talk to the principal and see if he Sir? did something. Oh, hello, Max. I hope this isn't about the alleged gun incident. There was a gun. Alleged? Nathan did have a gun. Yeah. Have you talked to him yet? Yes, he's deeply upset about this accusation. I don't blame him. 
Once I have all the facts, we'll talk. For the moment, focus on your schoolwork. I can't focus when I'm scared. Yeah. Please don't say that. There's nothing to be scared of at Blackwell Academy. The kid had a gun! Our head of security is overseeing a new era of campus safety. Oh, he's putting in cameras surveillance. Now let's say about hassling Kate. I saw Mr. Madsen hassle Kate Marsh yesterday. Wait, wait. Do you see a pattern here, Max? What? Probably not things. the same one <laughs> you see. It's very easy for you to instantly accuse people of doing terrible things. Nathan, Mr. Madsen, who's next? Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a meeting. Let's rewind a little bit. Let's see what it says about the other bit. Surveillance. Mr. Madsen already treats everybody here like they're under surveillance. Wait, wait. Uh, Do you doesn't see matter what we say. Couple... Where the it's problem? Right. What else have we got around here? We've got Mr. Madsen. Courtney. Let's see what hey, she Courtney. says. Ciao, Max. No photos, please. I have to come up with a guest list for a Vortex Club soiree. Really? Oh, like you care. <laughs> I do and I don't. <laughs> I do from a... I think someone in the Vortex Club I'm is... I'm not anti-soiree. You seem anti-fashion, though. Uh, a Vortex Club party has a strict up. dress code. Oh, sorry. Do you even have a dress? <laughs> sorry, but nice try. Oh, <laughs> what a bad. Hey, Courtney. Chat. Really? Oh, like... So what if we say dress code? I'm sure the Vortex Club has a dress code. <laughs> As you can see, I would need your advice on oh, what to wear. Oh, smart going, Max. Thanks, Max. I didn't think you noticed high fashion. Tell You're you wearing that. jeans and I'll a t-shirt. I'll put you on the guest list, and before the party, I can give you some tips. Cool. Thanks, Courtney. I don't know if I want to go. I'll send you the party info later. Back to the list. Oh, God. Now I'm going, but I didn't want to go. Now I'm going. Oh, no. Ah, we'll leave it. We can do some reconnaissance. So, Mr. David? Excuse me, Mr. Madsen? I know things got a little heated yesterday in Chloe's room. Was that really your reefer? Is he apologizing right now? Yes or no? I don't want to throw Chloe under the bus now. Yes, it was. You know that marijuana is almost legal in Oregon. I can get it at Blackwell. Are you going to bust me now, Mr. Madsen? Even I'm not that much of an asshole. And I am sorry about yesterday. Okay. I was wrong, but upset. Cannabis is not a big deal to you, but it has been to Chloe. You're a combat veteran. She's no threat to you. If I didn't care about her, I wouldn't care at all. When I was her age, I was out raising a lot more hell. She's better than that. All you kids are. So is Kate Marsh. You treat Kate bad, what about Kate? Oh, I'm going to question it and see what he says. What about Kate? You step between us at a pretty bad time. She's another matter entirely. About what? Kate hasn't done anything wrong. Yeah. Max, this isn't just about Kate Marsh. My concern is for the safety of all Blackwell students, including you. That'll take more than surveillance cameras. It will take more than Ms. Grant and her petition to find missing students. Isn't that your responsibility as head of security? Unless you know something about Rachel Amber that nobody else does. Ooh, Max. I don't want to fight with you anymore. I don't want to fight with anyone anymore. That's all, Max. Interesting. This is very interesting. I don't dislike him as much as I did after that conversation, I feel like. What does Warren say? Hey, girl. Sit down, science something. I'm in a sci-fi lab now. I know Schrodinger's kitty. See you soon. I still have time. I could go see Warren playing mad scientist in the lab. Okay, where is science? I don't know where science is. How many students ever actually memorize all this shit? I am actually I guess we all should looking these at this map. Don't be judgy, Max. Ah, oh, science is opposite arc. That's an interesting decision. Old science stuff in my high school was on the opposite end. Like, totally different building. Miss Grant. So she was doing a petition for students? Miss Grant is so cool and smart. She defines the word teacher. You like your teachers, don't you, Max? Chemistry stuff and Warren! Sup? Hey, Warren. Are you okay? You look thoughtful yet confused. That's my constant Maxwell state. Silver Hammer! What? Perfect timing! 
I need help with this chemical experiment. Mm -hmm. Asking me for help means you're screwed. I have to add either a bit of potassium or sodium. It's up to you to decide, Dr. Max. Uh, so, but aren't they both potassiums not reactive? I can't remember science. I'm not sure why you're letting me decide your fate, but go... Potassium. Potassium it shall be. If this works, you get a free hug. Okay, you guys stop trying to make moves on me, man. Whoop, was that bad? Weird science. That... So wait, so we go back. I feel like that was not right. <laughs> hey, Warren. Say so what? Hexwell's... Asking... Have to... Blah, 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 blah. Lots of potassium. <laughs> I actually think you should use a lot of potassium. I mean, a shitload. Yeah. See? Look at that smile. You're going to become a scientist yet. Let's do this thing. That's gonna blow up in your face, man. <laughs> she blinded me with science. Was that bad? Was that bad? Yes! That was a blast! But let's keep it a professional secret. Cool? I didn't know potassium. This can't be that hard. That's not what we're meant to do. I have a vision. Go diem. Godium? That's the worst one <laughs> I've ever heard. Yet Max has spoken. <laughs> really is. Sodium it is. <laughs> so gonna react. Nothing? Damn. Zip. Ah. Nothing. Nada. Is that it? Why did I go for that? What did we get out of that? Hi, Miss Grant. Funny, I was just thinking about you, Max. Really? It's too bad you didn't sign the petition. Every I'm sorry, I didn't know counts, there was one. And yours might be the one that decided. Petition? How is your campaign going? It's missing somebody who should care. Wow. But no finger pointing in, Max. Oh, no, no, no. More people would rather send a text than sign a petition. Agreed. That's how they keep us all distracted. Conspiracy. Nobody will notice cameras on every square foot. Some of us want to use our cameras for good. But people like David Matson want to use them as spies. Jeez, I'm not like him, Miss Grant. I know, Max. But the trick is to make sure Blackwell Academy does not end up like him. As in paranoid? Miss Grant, can I ask you a possibly dumb science question? You know my stock teacher answer. There are no dumb questions. Ask away. Would you add potassium or sodium to a chemical mix for this week's experiment? Neither. Unless you want a face full of powder, I would add chlorine. Oh, I know things now. Now I get the point of it. I'm just thinking about all the autumn photos I want to take. Oh, this is my favorite time of year. Same. I do love the season change. This whole campus is a visual delight. I know Mr. Jefferson loves to shoot around here. Oh. You must know Mr. Jefferson pretty well by now. I certainly know him as a talented artist and terrific teacher. Maybe he's the better of. I've been here a little longer, but he's made a bigger mark. I have to say, it's not quite autumn enough yet. Snow? What about that snow yesterday? What's your oh, scientific that's explanation? Oh, that's a good question. I'll go stop reading the subtitles before they talk. <laughs> of course, some of the tribes here might see it different. I'm sorry, Miss Grant, but. I have to get going. Interesting. Go on, Max. We'll talk again. Real soon. Now we can fix his experiment, because I know what I'm meant to be doing now. Add chlorine. Wrong, Warren. You need to add chlorine. Not potassium or sodium. Yeah. Chlorine? I didn't think of that. Can't Did argue you? with a confident scientist. Let's try Why would Max have this information if she's a photographer? Oh, it's gone pink now. Interesting. Should you be looking at that without glasses? Eureka! She's got it. What is no, it? No, you got it. Don't be so modest, Dr. Caulfield. Good day. <laughs> so what was the point in that? That was fun helping Warren. He's pretty cute when he's in full-on geek mode. Aww. I guess we go to class now. I'm trying not to read all the subtitles. It's a really bad habit. I'm reading them ahead of... Uh, when they're saying it, so I'm laughing at things before they happen. You can't help me. This is your way. I'm trying. But you have to understand my position. Kate? Kate? Why? 
You don't understand mine. Nobody does. Nobody. Kate, 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 Kate. I'm just gonna keep following you until I can interact with you. Kate! Hey! Hello? Just leave me alone! Okay. Let's go ask the teacher about that in a non accusatory tone. Hello, Mr. Jefferson. What Excuse happened? Excuse me, Max. Can you come over here? Sure. You look worried. Is everything okay? I just saw you Sorry to bother you, Mr. <laughs> Jefferson. I'm only bothered when you avoid turning in photos. But you know this. So what can I do for you, Max? What just just between you and me, I'm worried about Kate Marsh. That's no secret. Word on the street is that you and Kate had a little confrontation with our security chief yesterday. Yeah, well... I Kate stepped in between David Madsen barking all up in Kate's face about something. She doesn't deserve that. Of course not. <laughs> Mr. Madsen isn't the most gentle soul. No. Do you have proof he instigated the situation? My word isn't good enough? <sighs> the one time I choose not to take a picture. Always take the shot. What? My number one rule of photography. Yeah, and take a photo. I promise this matter is being discussed by the faculty. I assume you know about this viral video? Kate is freaked out. Kate is freaked out by all of this. She can't do homework while she's being tormented on a daily basis. What if Kate brought this on herself? What? She means well, but maybe she doth protest too much. Oh, fuck off. She seems like she's holding back the truth. Have you talked to her? I'm so... I am sorry. Someone took a video of her without her consent and put it online and that's her fault? Uh. Yeah, I'll fucking talk yes, to her. I talked to her on the phone today. She needs friends and support. Thank you, Max. That's I just don't want Kate Marsh to become the next Rachel Amber. Rachel Amber? What does she have to do with Kate? With we all don't know, do we? Around, it's hard not to think of her. I miss Rachel too. But think about yourself, Max. Principal Wells told me about what you said happened in the bathroom. Yeah, it's all our fault. It did happen. Nathan Prescott had a gun in the girls' bathroom yesterday. This is a serious accusation. Max. You don't think I don't know so that? You don't believe me? I would never make something like this up. I hope so, Max. But it's easy to point fingers. If Mr. Madsen claims you might be a pot dealer as he did, should I believe him? Listen, should I? Excuse me, Max. Are you fucking kidding me? Hello. Yes. Uh, hold on. Why is your phone so small? I have so to take small? this. So just go into class, and I'll be there soon. Hands. He's not as cool as you thought he was. Can I sneaky listen in on his phone uh -huh. conversation? Fine, whatever, fuck, sake. Stella. Make me beautiful, Hayden. Bo. 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 Let's talk to Alyssa. Are you gonna get something thrown at you? Control. Turn left, then right. Show me the love. How do I look to love? You are the Hey, Alyssa. Not now, Max. I'm contemplating shit. Okay, sorry. Contemplate away. Nathan and Victoria are talking to each other. What's going on? Oh, they're buds. Do you think Max will be pissed we're sitting at her desk? Oh. Better be quiet, Victoria. We have a master snitch and liar here. Uh. Did you think we were best friends forever or something? Not at all. Oh. Max, this is such an attention whore. Audio just cut out. <laughs> you would know. Can I sit down now? <laughs> oh, please do. Take a selfie of this moment. I want to punch you in the face. Yeah. Don't forget you. Assholes. Yeah. Fuck. I hate you both. You're so dodgy. Guess we'll just sit and start class, hey? So wait, I'm doing drawing as well as photography? Oh, Kate. Okay, why is David taking photos of Kate? Now this is so wrong. 
and weird. Yeah. Can we go out there and do something? What are we doing, Max? Why are we just sitting here, Max? Warren! We're gonna go see what's happening. What up, Max? Hey, Warren. I saw Kate earlier and her eyes were puffy from crying. Yeah, she wouldn't talk to me. Kate has a lot on her plate. I didn't know what to say and she, she didn't tell me anything. Okay, I know you love me, but if you're not in this class, beat it. Everybody else, please sit Maybe down. I'll see we have you a later. lot to cover right. today and so little time as usual. I see all the usual suspects here. Anybody seen Kate Marsh? I think everybody has seen Kate Marsh by now. <laughs> She's not feeling good. Sounds like Seriously? you're giggling about a video gone viral. Maybe it involves a student? It's cool that Mr. Jefferson published his own little book of photo tips. Is it? Or a friend? I wonder how it would feel to have false images of yourself shot out all over the yeah. world for people to judge. Usually, people need something to judge so they never take a good look at themselves. We can thank reality TV for some of that. In the end, we can only blame ourselves what for participating. Have we drawn? Is that the principal? <laughs> Speaking of participation, there are a few souls here who have yet to enter a photo in the contest. That like Max. That wouldn't be me. Let's just see our message from Chloe before we get reamed out by the teacher. Max, wish he had popped a cap in Frank's ass instead of giving him the gun. No, Chloe, I do not wish that, and neither do you. Is it too late to rewind? I'm not gonna try. Caulfield, for example. Who I know can't wait to enter, right? Oh, I'm getting there. I'm sure say. you read the syllabus like it was a Harry Potter book, so you must know today we're studying chiaroscuro. That beautiful word about the contrast between light and dark. Huh. The shadow play that gives photography such visual power. It's basic yin and yang. Black and white images are effective precisely because of their contrast. Interesting. I guess Kate will miss class see. now. What? I'm worried about her. Zachary, what? do not come into my class like that ever again. Crazy shit is happening. Listen, everybody remains. No, seated. we're gonna go see. What is happening? Dismissed. What is happening? Is this for real? Wait. Pitch flipped out. I didn't think she was that. Is this Kate? Wait. Kate? Kate! <gasps> no! Fuck, fuck! Oh god. Kate? I, I have to do something to help her. She can't die. She can't. <gasps> Rewind again and again. Okay. Shit. What do you even do? What do you even do? No way. You've all just got your phones out. Are you not going to help? Brooke's not watching. Kate. Keep going. Oh, Max. Max. You can do it. It's not letting me. I'm running through stop time and abstractly I think that's really cool but oh my god Warren's holding all this so that's really cute. What do you do? Oh he's trying to help. That's good of you. Come on Max. Fuck. Go to the roof. Come on. Come on, please get there, please get there, please get there, please get there. Yes. Keep going. Come on. Kate. Don't pass out now, Max. 
What? What are you doing here, Max? Stop! Don't come near me! Not now. I can't use it. It won't work. I don't have any power. Now I have to do this by myself. Fuck. Max, seriously, don't come near me. I will jump. Okay, okay. I'm right here. Kate. Oh my god, can I fuck this up? Oh, Max, I know you want to help me. I love that you stepped up to David, but it doesn't matter now. Nothing matters. Yes, it does. You matter not just to me. Things will get better. Um. Fuck. Okay, so I'm going to say you matter because when. I don't know if I want to talk about myself. I. When I've been in this place, things will get better is not something that, for me, I was able to believe because it's just so easy to go, no. And one of the things uh, that I've learned by going and talking to doctors and psychologists and things and uh, a coping mechanism, strategy that I've used is you can't decide what other people believe so for example my husband loves me and I know that he wouldn't lie to me so if he said to me that I matter I can't argue with him so this is what I'm saying to Kate you matter and not just to me I do want to believe Please, that Kate. Kate your life is still yours and we can get through this together let me help. I'm glad to hear you worry about me. That makes me feel better. You know, my friend, I'm here for you. I'm here for you. I'll always be here for you, Kate. My new motto is, friends come first. I will always answer you your I phone call. I did feel better talking to you on the phone. I always feel like you really listen. Please. Kate, please trust me. Come stand by me, okay? I can help you now. I know I can. Please. This morning I erased the web link to the video. It was written on the shower room mirror. Are you serious? I don't think Thank you need you to tell so her that, much. but sure. The fact that you don't care about that video and would come up here to stop me means a lot. Come on. You were drugged, Nathan is involved. You were drugged. I care about you because I believe you were drugged. We will find out who did this and make them pay. Come on, Kate. Sounds so persuasive, Max. If only. Come Kate, on. I believe you. Will you believe me? Please. You don't have to do this. Please, Kate. Max, I'm in a nightmare and I can't wake up. Uh, unless I put myself Is to sleep. Not... Then everybody at Blackwell can post pics of my body. I'm horny on the internet forever. No wonder they call it a web. Nothing can ever get out. Like my video. Aww. I wish I could go back in time and erase everything. Everybody will forget, be strong, there are billions of videos. Uh, be strong. Kate, this is our chance to beat the bullies. That's the only way we can win against them. Can we really, Max? I don't believe in miracles anymore either. Now I do. You're part of the reason why. If you come down with me, I can tell you more. Please. You're such a good person, Max. Even if you're full of crap. But I'll come with you. Oh, thank God. You're my friend. Thank God. Forever. Can we hug on it? Come on, Kate. No. Nobody cares about me. Nobody. Your mother, your father, your sister, your brothers. Your mum? What about your mother, Kate? You'll destroy her. She doesn't care about a video. She loves you. You don't know my mother at all. She already thinks Satan has me on the fast track to hell. Um, Let's prove it. No! Kate, please stop. Listen, this isn't the end, Kate. There's no way God doesn't have big plans for you here. Nice try, Max. But God put me on this route. Suicide is a sin. Matthew eleven twenty eight. Proverbs twenty one fifteen. I don't know the 
Bible? <laughs> oh my god. Oh. Shit. I am not enjoying this. How does that proverb go? When justice is done, it brings joy to the righteous, but terror to the evildoers. This is not justice, I don't Kate. believe in justice, Max. I don't believe in anything Please, anymore. Kate, calm down. You can't change anything if you- <gasps> for any of us. But we have to go over what happened before Miss Marsh, before she did what she did. Officer Barry will be taking notes for the official police inquiry. I'm sure you'll give him your full cooperation. Such a tragedy. But there must be a reason for everything. We need to find out why Kate Marsh would be driven to such desperate action. Is this how people really react? To As this? principal of Blackwell Academy, I take my duties seriously. I take the well-being of every student more seriously. What happened today should never happen in a hall of wisdom and knowledge. Mr. Madsen, as our head of security here, those roof doors should always be locked. That's just standard operating procedure. They were not, and that is indeed your responsibility. Mr. Jefferson, I know you can't be expected to know what your students are going through, but Kate has assisted you in class, so you should have known something was amiss. No. Mr. Prescott, since you are responsible for the Vortex Club parties, and since Miss Marsh did attend your last party, you'll have to answer some more questions. Miss Caulfield, why exactly were you on the roof with Kate You're Marsh? You're the fucking police! Did she tell you her plan? Or anything at all? Please, tell us everything. Nathan Dosa, Jefferson made her cry, David bullied her. I have to pick who I'm saying about. What the fuck? Thing is, the Jefferson thing, it's like, that's the tipping point, but that's not everything and obviously someone who's going to that level there is a whole myriad of things going on and I don't know if I'm okay with how this game is treating this right now I don't know if I'm processing it right I just and everyone being in the room this is not how this goes Nathan Doster. All I know is that Kate was at a party and Nathan dosed her. She got wasted and kissed some boys on a viral video without a clue. I dosed her? <laughs> without a clue. Have you seen the video? Whatever. This is Kate was loaded and You're a liar. The field. You told Kate you took her to the emergency room. I said I was going to take her to the ER. She sobered up eventually. Bullshit. Something happened to her and you know it. How about we talk about you waving a gun in the girl's hey, bathroom? Hey, that's total slander. I could sue you and this school so fast. I already have a personal lawyer. Oh, good for you. Careful, Mr. Prescott. I have been told of this alleged gun incident, and I have to admit that the video in question was sent to me by multiple sources. Including me. And since Mr. Prescott does appear prominently in the video and was responsible for the party, I have no choice but to suspend him until further notice. What a but, Excuse me. I think Max and Nathan need a break before we grill them further. A yeah. friend and fellow student is dead. 
They don't need this phone. Also, this isn't how things yes, go, right? I'm kind of devastated. Oh, yeah, you sound it. I'd like to be with my family. You're fuck All right, Miss Caulfield, please sign here to confirm what you've told us. I'll continue this investigation from there. My head is killing me, but I think I can use my power again. To what? Say someone else? I'm kind of happy that I said it was Nathan. As far as, like, that's the only decision I get. Whatever. This is stupid. Well, I think we know less now than when we started. We'll be assisting the police with further inquiries. I know this has been a stressful day. I wish I had the power to change it all for the better. I know that's just dialogue so to be significant. You know, due to the mechanics of the game. Oh yeah, we're gonna see more of you around. I don't even know where this game is gonna go. Like, I feel like it should stop. Maybe this is what I it's showing us. I just can't believe it. It's like it wasn't even real. Watching her drop like a oh weight. Oh god, we're gonna be talking about it. I really thought I could save her. Like a superhero. Come on, Max. Do not for a second blame yourself. Thank you, Warren. Kate was on that roof for her reasons, not yours. My hand just reached out. Stop it. You were the only one with balls enough to run to the roof. You were the only one who cared. Yeah, I sure made a big fucking difference. Maybe if more people cared, better people than me. You're the best person around. Warren, I screwed up today. That makes no logical sense. Warren, I don't mean to sound weird, but there's something ominous going on at Blackwell. There today definitely is. That. And I'm working on proof that Kate Marsh is connected to Rachel Amber. Somehow. Along with Nathan and Mr. Madsen. I'm not a big conspiracy guy, but I wouldn't doubt it. Nathan did scare me yesterday, and Madsen is a straight-up dickhead. So, what do you think is really happening? Are we going to tell him now about my rewinding? What the hell is this? Have we got more weird snow? The eclipse the now. The weather confirms this weird day. I feel that chill. Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. I would know. I would. Is this literally the end of the episode now? I feel like... Oh. I believe you, Warren. I believe anything this week. That was a nice little touching moment. Oh, I feel like, yeah, this is going to be the very end of it, so... a nice moment for them. I think he does feel bad about leaving the roof unlocked. Why was it unlocked? That's an interesting point.
there is another folder put up right now that says Kate, seriously, you're making a Kate folder. What the fuck is going on? What is this? So now we're going to see all our choices. Most people said to wait for more proof. Oh, that was awful. I didn't tamper with the rail tracks. What? I'm now going to be really worried about this train tracks situation. <laughs> I think I'm just going to tack this on to the end of uh, the other episode because this was so short and doesn't really make sense uh, by itself. Still apprehensive about going into the next episode. That was very heavy with Kate. I'm still upset about how they handled it, the developers. I didn't like that at all from a gaming point of view. I think it was a bad decision to use the mechanics in that way. And I don't think my mind can be changed on that. I think it could have been handled better. But overall, I still think the way that this story is playing out is interesting. Yeah, and I will see you next week. Bye.